Question one, using the information that 6.7 times 52 is 348.4, we need to find the value of 6.7 times 520. So we're dealing with a related calculations problem here. So if you look, 6.7 times 520 should produce an answer that is 10 times bigger than what we've been shown. And that's because 520 is 10 times bigger than 52. So the answer to this problem should be 300 or 3,484. Part two, we're asked to work out the value of 67 times 0 0.52. Now, in order to do that, I'm just gonna write down the calculation they gave us again, 6.7 times 52 equals 348.4 and I'm going to start to adjust the problem so that I get towards first of all 67 and then I'm going to adjust it again so that we get the 0 0.52. So similar to before um, if we just do 67 times 52 we should get an answer that's 10 times bigger than what we have. And that's because 67 is 10 times bigger than 6.7. So we should get 3,484. And now I need to adjust the 52 so that we get 0 0.52. So I'm gonna leave the 67 alone. And if I was to multiply that by say 5.2, I'm gonna get an answer that's 10 times smaller. Three, four, eight. 0.4 and one more adjustment because I don't want 5.2 I want 0 0.52 so let's make it 10 times smaller again 0 0.52 here is going to give us an answer again that's 10 times smaller than this which is going to be 34.84 so let's just write that down here 34.84 and then finally we want to work out 3484 divided by 5.2 now, before I do that, what I'm gonna do is rewrite the original fact, but as a division. So the, the digits three, four, eight, four are the first thing to appear. So in this case, I know that three, four, eight point four divided by, and the five and the two the digits five, two are here. So again, I'm going to divide by the 52. Let's just move this down a tad bit. So just moving that down a little bit. We get that must be equal to 6.7. 6.7. Now what I'm going to do is just adjust the problem again. So I need to make the um, 3, 4, 8.4 bigger. So I'm going to make it 10 times bigger to make it 3,484, which was required in the question. And let's leave everything else alone. Divide that by 52. Must give me, now think about it, if I make the numerator, if, I, if, I, if the number I'm dividing by or dividing into, should I say, gets bigger, then my answer should be bigger. So that should be 67. And then similarly, I need to make the 5.2 smaller. So let's write it down again. 3, 4, 8, 4, divided by 5.2. Now be very, very careful here. I'm, now I'm dividing by something that's 10 times smaller, which means my answer is going to have to get bigger because the, the bit I'm sharing it into is a smaller amount. So it's going to be 10 times bigger, 670. Let's write that last one down and then we're done.